Hey, what is up you guys? Welcome to or welcome back to my channel. My name is Josh and I'm a makeup artist from New York and I have a brand new video for you guys today. Today, I'm gonna do my makeup in unalphabetical order. <laughs> so if you guys remember, like I think it was last year or two years ago, who knows? Everyone was doing their makeup in alphabetical order. Oh God. <laughs> in alphabetical order. So now I'm gonna do it in unalphabetical order. So backwards. <laughs> So yeah, I don't know, maybe it'll catch on. And I started a new challenge, you see? Gotta think outside the box. There's not even a box here, but someone put a box around me. Editor, even though I'm the editor. <laughs> no, but yeah, so we're gonna be doing the unalphabetical makeup challenge. That's officially what I'm calling it. But yeah, if you guys want to see a uh, probably complete fail, honestly, because this is already looking like a mess, make sure to keep on watching. So we're going to start off with Morphe's Continuous Setting Mist. This is S, so the last letter, because there's nothing else that's like any other letter all the way and there's nothing like I don't know, whatever who, who knows <laughs> so I'm gonna just set my face with no makeup on if that's not weird I don't know what is <laughs> that's the pre primer that's the primer for the primer you know that's that's gonna be 2020 next P so we're going in with primer this is the Bobbi Brown enriched vitamin face base so next letter is M for mascara of course so we're gonna go in with the benefit roller lash mascara cold favorite of course so I've set my face with no makeup on, primed, and put on my mascara. <laughs> so next, we have, of course, highlight. So we're going to go in with the Jeffree Star Cosmetics 24 Karat Gold Highlighting Palette. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. So with no foundation or concealer on my face, I'm going to, of course, <laughs> highlight now. So we're going to go into shade Sarcophagus, which is the first shade in the palette. Okay, I mean the highlight's sickening though. And of course we're gonna do the nose and the bridge of the nose. Can I just say this highlight does look amazing on just the skin by itself? Like, it looks really blinding and really, really, not natural, but like, it's my skin tone color, so you can't see like a color from it. I just shine. I wear this like every day and just be blinding people <laughs> constantly. All right. So while well, I'm distracting myself of the mess that's ahead, <laughs> next we have L. So lip gloss. So we're gonna go in with the Jeffree Star Cosmetics The Gloss in the shade Sorcery. Nope. In the shade Iridescent Throne. This is the weirdest YouTube video I've ever made. All right, next we're going in with foundation, of course. <laughs> the seventh thing. So we're gonna go in with the Bobbi Brown's Skin Longwear Weightless Foundation. And I'm in the shade Golden Honey, if anyone's wondering. I already did a video on this, you guys go go check that out. If you don't know, I'm putting the foundation over the highlight, unfortunately. <laughs> okay, besides the fact that this is super weird, you can low-key still see the highlight under the foundation. Like, just a bit. Like, it's a little bit brighter in that spot, obviously, because that's kind of how paint works, too. I should have gotten in with liquid highlighter. I'm so dumb, because then it would have blended. Mm. I don't have any anyways. <laughs> Alright, I mean, I don't hate it so far. Next, we're going to go in with eyes, so uh, or eyeshadow. And we're gonna go in with the Jeffree Star Cosmetics Blue Blood Palette. So I'm just gonna whip something up for you guys. Oh, it doesn't make a sound. No satisfying sound. I forgot to prime my eyes before, but I think it falls under eyes. So I'm gonna do eye primer, then eye shadow. <laughs> Obviously I'm gonna prime my lids with the MAC Painterly Paint Pot in the shade Lane Low. I don't use Painterly cause I'm not that pale. <laughs> Did you guys see the brand new um, Norvina 4 palette with Anastasia Beverly Hills? It looks amazing. The other ones were super, super colorful, but this one's like that nudish pink purplish, and it's really, really nice. I low-key think I might have to get it. Leave a comment down below if you guys want to see a video for that. It comes out, I believe, the 15th. 
But yeah, so now that I've primed my eyes, I'm gonna go in with Blue Blood. It's the shade with the little crown. And I'm just gonna put that as my base shade all over my lid. Hopefully I don't get fallout because I don't have anything under my eye. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie that the blue's a little patchy, but I am a little darker. Um, so it usually are a little patchy for me. That's why I don't go with blue too much. But it, it's pretty buildable though. With the shade I'm cold, I'm gonna blend it out at the top. It's pretty nice so far. I like that. I like how this is coming out so far. So now I'm gonna go in with my finger and I'm gonna dip into crystal flesh and I'm gonna put that in the inner corner. And that is one eye so far. And I like that. It's pretty basic, but I don't hate it. And I'm just gonna take a Morphe 321 brush and I'm gonna pick up the shade Cullinan and I'm gonna put that in my inner corner. Oh yeah, that's like face tune for your inner eye. Wow, holy fuck, <laughs> that is nice. Okay, so I'm gonna do the other eye off camera and I'll be right back. So here I am with the other eye done. I actually like how it came out. It's like super basic, but it actually is really nice and I didn't hate the blue too much. It's like that touch of blue with some nice champagne. Next, I'm gonna go in, oh wait. <laughs> I don't know what, oh, this is C technically. Cream gel liner, C. <laughs> C, is this this way? I don't know, my camera's back. <laughs> okay, wait. This is a C to me. So to you guys, this is not a C. This is a C. <laughs> not just anyway. Never mind. Anyways, I'm gonna go in with the ColourPop gel cream cream gel liner in the shade Get Paid. And it's like a bronze almost shade champagne that I put on my inner corner. So I'm gonna put this on my waterline. I like how the look is coming together. It's looking very nice so far. It's not as bad as I thought it would be. Cause like I just saw the products in front of me in alphabetical order and I was like but it's not that bad, honestly. We should make a makeup product that starts with the letter Z. <laughs> Zenzealer. <laughs> Zybrows. <laughs> Zybrow pencil? The Zybrow pencil. Okay, so, so far I'm actually liking it. I'm not even gonna lie. <laughs> Next, we have concealer. Finally, we have made it to concealer. C. <laughs> we made it all the way to the end of the alphabet to the beginning. <laughs> oh wait, I'm gonna go in with the Il Maquillage. Flawless as fuck concealer in the shade 10. So the only issue we're having now is that since I did my foundation, usually when you do your makeup, you do like a maybe concealer and then a few things then foundation or foundation then a few things and concealer. So they become brother and sister. Nah, <laughs> this is niece and great grandpa. <laughs> I put the foundation on yesterday and then I just put the concealer. But I mean, honestly, it's looking pretty nice. Not gonna lie. Who would have thought? Who would have thought I would have came through in this challenge at the end? Next, we have B, and of course, we're gonna go in with bronzer first. We have the Marc Jacobs Coconut Tan Bronzer in the shade Tantalize, and I'm gonna go, <laughs> and I'm gonna go in with my Marc, Marc Jacobs, <laughs> and I'm gonna go in with my Scott Barnes number 67 brush, not my Marc Jacobs brush, I don't have any of those. The only bronzer I know in the whole world is that one. <laughs> and last but certainly not least, we made it to blush. And I have the Anastasia Beverly Hills Blush Trio in the shade Peachy Love. And I'm gonna go in with my Scott Barnes number 64 brush. And that was the final step to the unalphabetical makeup challenge. <laughs> and like every other freaking video, it came out pretty good. <laughs> nah, I actually low key enjoyed it because it was a complete mess from the start. I saw the highlighter before foundation and I was like, this is gonna be a mess. I thought it was gonna get cakey. Honestly, I had setting powder in there first for S. I took that shit out because if I would have done setting spray, setting powder primer, I would have been fucked from the get go. But honestly, I pulled through honestly but that's pretty much it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed you guys should try this challenge and tag me 
that's what you guys should do definitely 100 <laughs> percent make sure you guys leave a comment down below what you liked most about this video and make sure you guys check out my podcast think of the podcast there's a brand new episode every single week and also make sure you check out think of the merch the merch is coming out for the podcast very very soon so make sure you guys go to the website and sign up for 20 percent off when we launch the link will be down below in the description i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace Thank <laughs> you.